What, what's going on, people? It's Flight Sports TV. I appreciate y'all for checking with me. I'm not going to hold the people too much. We got breaking news in the NBA right now, ladies and gentlemen. Lonzo Ball is undergoing arthroscopic knee surgery, ladies and gentlemen. He should be out uh, four to six weeks. Um, this is He's cleaning out uh, his knee. You know, obviously, we, we hear of all the situations that's going on you know, with that knee because it's been crazy. But like I said, right now we got breaking news in the NBA. We appreciate everybody for rolling in right now. We got ourselves a whole lot to discuss tonight. Like I said, this is just going to be the appetizer, ladies and gentlemen. It's, um, this, this, this stuff keeps getting crazier and crazier. People may view this however way they might want to view this. But in my humble opinion, I don't think this is nothing that anybody needs to trip about. Uh, with Lonzo Ball. You, you can say he, you don't know that he's out for the season. The second knee surgery, like I said, they're going to reevaluate him in four to six weeks. You know, um, so that so right from there, you know, all I can let you know right there is that this is good. They're cleaning out the debridement in his knee. This is one step closer to Lonzo Ball taking the trip on that basketball floor, ladies and gentlemen. We are one step closer. You know, that's basically all the, the crux of what this whole situation is. You know, uh, this knee is this knee situation with his left knee has been just problematic to say the least. It's been horribly troubling, but I mean, it is what it is at the end of the day. You know, uh, Lonzo Ball will be back on the floor. Uh, the Bulls are going to do everything in their power to get this man out there. You know, I don't want you to think that's going to go over nobody's heads, you know, uh, because they're dealing with a crazy situation. They seen what it was like with no Lonzo. When no Lonzo is, the, they went to the sellers. You know, they're not trying to go back to the sellers, you know. Uh, so that's something that the Chicago Bulls are very cognizant of. You know, y'all let me know if my connection is coming in good right now. We got breaking news in the NBA. Lonzo Ball will be having a second knee surgery. I told you, we, we've been documenting this, ladies and gentlemen. I told you a week ago, he was meeting with the Bulls medical staff. He was in Chicago. We documented this shit from timeline to timeline to timeline, ladies and gentlemen. We did not miss a fucking beat on this situation, you know, um, but tonight I want to discuss some things on why it's not all doom and gloom. This is just the appetizer. Y'all let me know y'all thoughts. When, when y'all, What was y'all thinking when y'all heard this news on Lonzo and his second surgery? And, you know, this is something that LeVar Ball stated that Lonzo wasn't going to have. Um, I wonder if it was like an option where he could have had it or it was a possibility he didn't need it, you know, but obviously Lonzo elected not to have this surgery, you know, um, so it's, it's put the Bulls in a the, in the problematic situation. They know they have to do something, you know, uh, but it is what it is at the end of the day. Um, they have Zach Levine. They have DeMar DeRozan. They they, they got to get Lonzo back on the floor. And the Bulls are going to fight like hell to get him out there. Before they throw in the towel and shut him down for the season or put him out indefinitely, they're going to they're gonna hit or they're going to channel all the – all the situations on this. They're going to hit all the markets, make sure that they don't leave no stone unturned. People are saying, pray for Lonzo. I don't really think this is a situation that we need to lose our minds over just because he's having a second surgery. Obviously, this man, you know, we, we got to pray for him because this is a second surgery. But, but if, if we really dive deep into this whole situation, seriously, like I said, I'm going to try to do it as much as I can with the time that I have for you because this is just the appetizer. Tonight, we're going to go full-fledged on this situation. I'm going to have facts, details. I don't know who's going to pull up either. I'm going to get on, you know, I'm about to get on the phone with some powerful people. How about that? You know, um, it, it, listen, it, 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 I'm being 100 with you. This is crazy. If you think about it, just on the surface level, oh my God, second surgery. There was, this was always looming that Lonzo possibly needed a second surgery. When it first happened, they was like, yo, it's, it might, he might need a second surgery. Even when he was recovering, they asked La LaVar Ball, will Lonzo need a second surgery? He did say no, but there was a possibility that he, would may, he may have needed one, you know, but they elected to go in a different avenue, you know, as you can see. But, I mean, at the end of the day, it is what it is, man. Lonzo Ball will be back in no time, you know, in my humble opinion. You know, uh, we will uh, dive more into the situation to get full and uh, in, 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 de in depth details on this. That's why I said tonight we're going to break it all down. We're going to hear from various spectrums on what's going to go down. But this Lonzo news, it just continues to get, you know, um, crazier. But I'm happy that we're getting some. I told you, they're going to have to come up with a verdict with Lonzo before media day. So I think this is a good silencer. Listen, let's see what happens. I believe that this second surgery that Lonzo Ball is having right now, it takes care of the discomfort that he's feeling. 
you you heard what they said. This knee is structurally sound. Nothing wrong with the knee. There's no damage or nothing. The problem is that Lonzo is dealing with, you know, that the situation with his knee in terms of the discomfort that he's feeling. That that's gonna be over with with this second surgery. That's what I believe this cleanup is going to be. You know, this is cleaning up the fucking discomfort that Lonzo was feeling. That way he couldn't push it. He would start, he would practice a little bit, then they gotta pull him back. It, the knee was swell. They have to clean this knee out. You know, Zach Levine had this surgery as well. A lot of players had this surgery. A lot of people might think this is doom and gloom, but I'm telling you, if you look at the list of players that's in the NBA, you will realize that this surgery is very common. This is not, a, I, and I'm not trying to sugarcoat this shit to make it sound sweet for you, but I'm just telling you, people have this surgery on a daily. This is not the third surgery. I mean, like I said, I'm keeping it 100 with you. This is definitely something to look at. Shout out my man Zen Master in the building. Just pulled up. Salute to the legend. Everybody go subscribe to the Black Basketball Channel with Zen Master. You know, um, dude is official out here. He don't get enough respect here at Flight Sports. We're going to put the respect on him. Uh, listen, Zen, you're absolutely right. You know, absolutely right. That's something that we cannot shy from. You know, at the end of the day, that's something that Lonzo is going to have to put behind him when he gets on the floor. But as doom as gloom as it sounds, we are one step closer to Lonzo Ball getting on the floor, believe it or not. I'm telling you, they have to clean out this knee. The knee was fucking them. You understand? It was not allowing him to perform. Now they have to. This is going to correct it. Remember, I told you this. This is what the surgery corrects, y'all. You know, um, it, one step at a time, man. That's all I can let y'all know. One step at a time. You know, Lonzo Ball will be good. He'll be back on the floor in no time. Salute to all the ZO2 fans that was holding it down from the bottom, from the beginning. Never lost faith, never wavered. You understand? We gonna, Listen, we're going to party real soon. The Bulls going to hold down the fort. Let me tell you something right now. Y'all mark my motherfucking words. This is his second surgery. I'm telling you right now, after this shit come out, when they said that they're going to have the surgery, and within four to six weeks, he's going to be reevaluated. Don't be surprised in that four to six weeks, they start talking like, yo, Lonzo ready to go. Hey, that discomfort that we heard, I'm hearing that he ain't feeling that no more. Lonzo athleticism is back. The shot is back. I'm telling you. Remember I said this. Remember I told you this. This arthroscopic knee surgery is not doom and gloom, y'all. This shit is one step closer to us seeing the ZO2, the Chino Hills prodigy that we know and love. I haven't lost one. I believe in Lonzo. I told you. I don't know about y'all. I'm going down with the ship. I'm riding and I'm dying with Lonzo Ball and the Triple Bs and LaMelo, Jello and everybody. I don't know about y'all. Y'all jumping to the next best thing. I am going down with the motherfucking ship. Okay? Point blank period. If you're a real ZO2 fan, hit that goddamn like button and most definitely hit that subscribe button. It's Flight Sports TV. Let me tell you something. Tonight, we're going to shut this motherfucker down. From This is just the appetizer. I'm about to get on the phone with some powerful people. I'll see you tonight. It's Flight Sports. Flight Sports TV, man. That's my dude. I was with him. You heard what the man said. It's Flight Sports TV.